tell us about this place. Where are we? So we're at the new conservatory for the College of Biological Sciences. What do you hope that the public who's allowed in here can get out of this? We hope that they will be exposed to different plants that they've never seen before and kind of come into different biomes and kind of learn about the ecology of these biomes. Each room is designed to have an ecological story sort of embedded within it and so that's um, one of the things that we hope people will take away just besides learning about plants. Why did you choose these particular four biomes? We are very cognizant of conservation issues and there's a lot more um, funding and resources available for plants in the Northern Hemisphere. So we chose places that we thought um, really have high botanical diversity as well as the need for conservation. What about the research side of things? What's happening with that? Our main job is to educate students. We allow students to grow their own plants and do experiments. They sometimes dissect plants. Sometimes they just look and see that this is an example of a euphorbia plant. What amazed me all flowering plants have originated from the plants in this room. Yeah, basically this is the first flowering plant known and then every other plant that has a flower on it is then subsequently related to this plant. We'll have to come back in five you years. You have to. You'll see, see everything we use. Like in five years. Well, well, hopefully this will be filled up with trees. This room in particular will be, plants will be about waist height. Okay. And the leaves will look really similar, but when the flowers bloom, you'll get your proteas and your pin cushions and those really wild flowers that Kind of Beautiful people are flowers. Into. Yeah. Lisa, thanks for having us. Thank you for coming. The conservatory will eventually be open to the public, but the opening date has been pushed back to early June. We have a link with this story on care11.com. And if you have any gardening questions for Laura and Bobby, send a text to 763-797-7215.